guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Nay. What's up? If you're new here, hey guys, what's up? And happy 2019 to you all. I cannot believe it is the new year. That's crazy. 2018 flew by and I cannot believe we're here in 2019. It's weird to even say that. But yeah, so today's video is going to be super cool because I've never done any video like this before so yeah it's gonna be actually on my vision board for this year and that guy's kind of like hanging out back here so I've never done a vision board before so it was my first time and it was super exciting and I really loved how it came out and I really hope you guys enjoy it as well let me know if you made a vision board this year and what you put on your vision board if you guys want to know what my new year's resolution is and my 10 goals for 2019 as well as take a peek at my vision board that and just go ahead and keep on watching don't forget to give this video a big fat thumbs up and leave a comment down below let me know what your new year's resolution is for this coming year and yeah let's just go ahead and get right on into this video you guys this is my 2019 vision board you guys i really love how it turned out it was my first time ever making a vision board so I don't know how well I did, but I honestly love it. And yeah, I just want to go through and share with you what I put on here. So I guess let's start here at this corner. I put the little phrase yours for the taking just because I thought it was so cute and conquer 2019, wreak havoc. And then I have some pictures of the beach here just because I would really love to go somewhere tropical this year and maybe take a vacation haven't been on vacation in a while so I think that that would be super nice and then I just have one little phrase here that says a run of the world and I just thought that was cute and it kind of tied in with the whole like taking on 2019 theme that I got going on here and then here I just wrote in remember that you are blessed and rejoice there on the side just because I thought that those are really good reminders and then I have the YouTube logo logo of course just because I do want to focus a little bit more on my YouTube channel this year and just come out with some really cool content for you guys so yeah I had to stick that little YouTube logo there and then I wrote in the little saying she has fire in her soul and grace in her heart because that totally sums me up you guys I am a Sagittarius and I'm actually a double fire sign so I thought that that was super cute and I have been told that I have a heart of gold but <laughs> who knows but yeah I just thought that that was super cute and then I had to put enjoy the little things because too often I'm stressing out about the future and you know there's not too much that we can change so I had to put that there for a reminder yeah so I have get those gains there and then fruit all around just because I really want to focus on eating better and just being healthy to my body in general put treat yourself as well right by the fruit just because I thought that that was super cute because often I reach for like a cookie or a brownie and I could be reaching for you know some berries or something like that that would be so much more healthier so I just put that there as a little reminder and then this little guy I thought was super cute it says find your fire and I just thought that that was so adorable and then I put the word dance just because I haven't danced in years you guys and if you didn't know I honestly danced since I was three years old so it's something that I love with all my heart and I haven't done much of so I just thought that that was a cute little reminder to tie it in. I also have some butterflies throughout my board kind of in the center just because my boyfriend and I have this little saying that 2019 is going to be the year of the butterfly because 2018 was a really rough year for us and so we felt like it was more of a cocoon year and 2019 is going to be a year where we spread our wings and fly and just soar to new heights so I had to throw in some really cute butterflies as well I really love this one I think it's so so adorable but yeah I just had to add a couple of those guys in just because we are saying that it is the year of the butterfly and then of course I had to throw in some glam and glitter because I do want to be doing some more makeup tutorials this year 
one of my favorite sayings is of course never give up and I have to remind myself this a whole lot especially going through a lot of medical situations this is always in the back of my mind so I had to put it here on my board as well because we can never give up you guys a friendly little reminder there and in the center of my board it says make music to the Lord just because I do want to start getting back into my music you guys and I thought that that was a cute little reminder of course I put God goals growing and glowing just because I thought that those were so cute and right here it says don't worry be happy and that reminds me of my grandma so much because that's that's something that she used to say all the time and it's just a nice little reminder and I miss her so much so yeah it's just nice to have a little touch of her here and there and I have a little saying that says find your happy pace and I thought that that was so cute you guys because if you don't know I do have a pacemaker and um, what that means is essentially I have a little machine making my heart beat for me and I just thought it was cute like to find my happy pace because 2018 was a really rough year I did have heart surgery and I'm kind of getting back into my whole health and my new normal so I just thought that that was so adorable to put there so a great reminder to start 2019 out strong and finding my happy pace and here in the corner I put a little lighthouse because that also reminds me of my grandma and I miss her so much um but yeah there's also a bible verse here and I thought it was so cute it says let your light shine before others and it's Matthew 5 16 this was actually something from like an adult coloring book and I actually colored this myself and I just put that on my board just because I really love lighthouses you guys I actually have a tattoo of one on my side and yeah they remind me of my grandma and I miss her I know I've said that a whole a hundred times but yeah and then I put a little good skin is always in just because I do want to focus more on my skincare in 2019 because I am getting older and time does not go backwards and we only have one face you guys so we have to invest in it. And yeah, so right here, it just says shine brighter. And I actually got that from an Ulta magazine that I get sent to my house. But I thought it was so cute. And it's right next to the little scripture. Another picture of a beach here just to tie in the fact that I really want to go on a trip this year, you guys. I even have like a little forest looking thing here just because I would have really loved to go to like... Yosemite go you know somewhere in California and explore and be somewhere new that I haven't been before and then right here I thought this was so cute it's like a clothing brand or something but it says Vida La Bonita and it just says like live the good life you know so I thought that that was super cute let your style take center stage and right underneath I put God is good always because he is you guys and then right here it says makeup is art and you can see that I got that from one of my boxy charms actually and I thought it was so cute I've saved it and I had to put it on my vision board because I do want to do some more artistic makeup looks in this coming year and of course here we got Ariana Grande because she is such a queen and I would really love to go to one of her concerts you guys I've never been and I love her I'm literally obsessed so yeah I had to throw her on my vision board because I would love to go to one of her concerts and then right here and lastly on my vision board it says light up red hot and I just thought that that tied in the entire thing because you know it says let your light shine shine brighter light up red hot and find your fire and I just thought that those tied in so well so yeah you guys this is my 2019 vision board let me know what you put on your vision board in the comments down below because I would love to know what you put on your vision board since this is actually my first time making one so I would love to know some tips and tricks for next year's but I am so in love and I'm so happy that I made one and I can't wait to put this up and look at it every day and just remind myself of the good goals that I got going on in the future. But yeah. 
All right, you guys. So these are my 2019 goals and as well as my New Year's resolution. And actually, my New Year's resolution is to honestly seek God with all of my heart. Um, I've had a really rough year this year and I've needed him and he's always been there for me and God has been so good and so gracious to me and all I can do is get to know him better and have a more intimate relationship with him so that's what I plan to do in 2019 and you know just by reading my Bible spending time in prayer and just talking to him and having a more intimate relationship so yeah that is my New Year's resolution so my goals for 2019 the first one is to just read my Bible you guys I didn't do that as much as I would have liked to in 2018 and it was a really rough year and you know I just I need to read my Bible more so I put that as my number one goal for 2019 and right underneath I put create music and um, if you didn't know, I actually write music. I used to do songs and perform and yeah, it was a kind of a crazy time in my life and I really miss it. And so my number two goal is to just create more music and just be more myself. <laughs> and that's where number three comes in as well with dance. Um, I used to dance since I was like three years old, honestly, and I couldn't imagine life without dancing dance and music and god saved me from so much heartache in my life so wow i'm getting emotional crazy <laughs> but yeah um dance god and music honestly just saved me from a lot growing up so i just really want to get back to those so those are my three top goals for 2019 and then number four i put 100 days of makeup because i have done the 31 days of makeup in the past but i really want to do 100 days of makeup on instagram and number five is to read 12 books i said 12 just so that way i could read at least one a month i used to be a little bookworm honestly and could not get my head out of a book and I wish I was more like that so I put to read 12 books it's kind of a steep goal but I really think that I could achieve it because I love to read you guys so I'm really excited to get some new books in my system honestly so any recommendations on books on book series or like a good book in general please leave that in the comments I would love to know I would love to have a bunch of books ready to go for when I'm ready to read one. My number six goal is to have set days for my videos here on YouTube and I think that I'm gonna go with a Monday, Wednesday, and Friday days for uploads. I just think that that would be the easiest and best schedule for myself so yeah be looking out for new videos every monday wednesday and friday you guys so please leave some comments down below and let me know what kind of videos you guys want to see number seven goal is to have a date night once a week i think that that would be really nice for me and carlos just it's been a really rough year you guys like i said so i think that spending time with each other and especially like having date night once a week would be really nice um we don't go out too often so i think it would be a really nice idea to do that in the upcoming year and then i also put number eight buy appreciation gifts just because and um i always liked the thought of that so i really want to you know lead by example and put my thought into actions by buying appreciation gifts for others just because i love them and appreciate them and care about them and adore them and you know all of the above so yeah and number nine I put family and um like I said it's been a really rough year you guys um Carlos actually lost his mom this year in 2018 so I put a big focus on family just you never know and um love on the people that you got and I also just put family there just because you know Maybe someday in the future we're going to start our own family. So I just stuck that guy there. Just super big focus on family, you guys. So, yeah. I love you guys. You're my family. And, yeah, I'm always here for you, too. So we are one big happy family. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. No, just kidding. But, yeah, we are one big happy family here, you guys. So you guys are my focus as well. And my number 10 is to journal and or write a book. I put either or just because, you know, 
what if I want to write a book? I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I am such a journaler, you guys, if that's a word. But yeah, I love to journal and just write poems, songs, stories, all of the above. So yeah. All right, I have like makeup stains everywhere. That's so gross, but yeah. Um those are my goals and my new year's resolution for 2019, you guys. All right, guys. Well, that completes today's video. I really hope you enjoyed and yeah, it's weird that it's 2019 super crazy but I'm so excited for this coming year and all the things that it has to come and with that being said I am going to have a new upload schedule and that is going to be every Monday Wednesday and Friday of every single week yeah so be expecting new videos on those days guys so leave a comment down below and let me know what kind of videos you guys want to see whether it be makeup tutorials lifestyle videos um heart vlogs or recovery vlogs or anything regular vlogs, anything like that. So yeah, know what your New Year's resolution is this year and if you made a vision board. And yeah, what are your goals? I would love to know. Let's chat in the comments down below. I can't wait to see what 2019 brings us and I just pray for lots of blessings for you all. And yeah, with that being said, peace and love to you always and I hope to see you in my next video. See you later, alligator. Bye!